This fight really has gotten a lot of press, and rightly so. Uh, one thing I can guarantee you, you're going to see a very, very exciting fight. Two guys who are going to leave it all in the ring, two guys who are coming uh, to get a victory, two guys who lost each lost their previous fights, and now this fight is for redemption. Uh, the winner of this fight goes on to a lot better things, a lot bigger things, uh, and the loser still has a great career, but he still will be burdened by the loss. So this is a really, really terrific fight. And now I'd like to introduce the team for Mike Alvarado. Uh, good friends of ours, uh, the manager, uh, Henry Delgado. Uh, I'd like Henry to come up and say a few words, uh, introduce the trainer. Henry is a hell of a guy. I mean, it's been a real great pleasure working with him and getting everything straight. You know, it hasn't been easy. Yeah, I'd like to do that. I'd like to introduce our team here. It's uh, Sean Bilhar. He is uh, Mike Alvarado's chief trainer. Uh, I'd like to thank Bob Barham and uh, the Top Rank family because uh, we've been with them from day one, and uh, it's it's been awesome. Uh, they're a top promotional company. I know that for a fact, you know, because it's family. We feel a uh, part of the family, and uh, after Mike's last fight. Uh, there was not even a, a, a hesitation in putting Mike Rack back in there. You know, Mike Top Rack takes care of their fighters. I uh, just want to thank uh, Marquez. Uh, he's been one of my favorite fighters, and I know he's been one of Mike's favorite fighters. And we have all the respect in the world for him. You know, and uh, they both of them have never been in a boring fight. I can't say that. Either one of them has been in a boring fight, and uh, it's going to be nothing but fireworks. And uh, I see strategy out the window. I see two guys uh, just getting getting down and getting to business, and it's going to be a, a exciting fight. You know, I just want to thank everybody for coming. And I introduce you to Mike Alvarado. You know, this fight is a co-promotion with our uh, great Mexican partners, Zanfra Promotions. Uh, we have been promoting many, many fights together for many, many years, and Zanfra Promotions is led by its great leader, uh, Fernando Beltran, who has been working closely with us for so many years, going back to the first uh, uh, De La Hoya Chavez fight, right? Uh, where he handled the uh, closed circuit in Baja, California, and uh, had an answer for certain riots that took place in certain bars because there wasn't enough room to have all the people come in. So please welcome uh, our great co-promoter, Fernando Beltran. We we'll introduce the Mark S. D. Uh, good afternoon to everyone. Uh, it's a real pleasure to be here. Uh, always uh, when a uh, fighter, a uh, legend fighter like Juan Manuel Marquez is involved in a fight, it's, uh, it's an honor, an honor to be here sitting with him. And uh, we respect a lot uh, Alvarado's team. Uh, we know that uh, he's a great fighter. He's a, he's a warrior. Uh, we, I'm, I'm his fan. We have following his career, and uh, right now, uh, having uh, the team of Juan Manuel Marquez, it's a real pleasure to introduce to you, uh, first of all, the, the Hall of Famer, trainer, and uh, manager, Ignacio Beristain. Nacho. <laughs> Good afternoon to everyone. La presencia de un peleador como Alvarado 
the presence of a fighter like Alvarado garantiza de alguna manera una pelea de muy alto espectacularidad. It's a real guarantee that uh, it's going to be a high, high uh, action fight. Un peleador que aguanta, pega, tiene un boxeo bastante agradable. Y yo creo que es una combinación con Juan Manuel Márquez, una, una gran, pero gran pelea que la gente de California no se puede perder. It's a fighter that can take a punch, he can punch him, uh, himself. And also, uh, he's got a great boxing ability, and it's a fight that uh, nobody from California should miss. Espero que Alvarado y Márquez les regalen el sábado una gran velada. I, I wish that uh, Alvarado and Márquez uh, this Saturday bring you all, to all the fans, a great evening of boxing. Va a ser una gran velada porque todos los peleadores que respaldan esta función tienen gran calidad. It's going to be a great evening of fighting because uh, all the fighters who are in the undercard, uh, they, they have a great quality of boxing. So, gracias, señores. Thank you very much. Also, uh, uh, he's, been, uh, he's been training with us since the first Pacquiao fight. Uh, we did some changes in the Marquez team. And uh, it's been a pleasure working with him and his father, who's in the audience. Uh, I would like to introduce uh, to you to uh, Guillermo Heredia, who is a real, real asset to our team. Hello, everyone. Uh, I want to thank everyone to be here, especially my father, Dr. Gatica, the rest of the team, Fernando Beltran, he's been a good friend of mine. He's been with us for a while. I'm very honored to be with someone like Marcus. He's proven along to a lot of people that age doesn't, is not really a factor. Some believe it is, I don't. And I'm just very happy to be among two great fighters. Alvarado is proven he's a tremendous fighter. Even, if, even that he lost two fights, he's hungry for it. So it's gonna be a good match. Two great fighters going at each other. And, and I'm sure it's gonna be a tremendous fight. And I'm just honored to be here and be part of Easter as well. Thank you very much. We signed Mike Alvarado out of the amateurs, and we knew he was a terrific fighter. But I really got a shock a number of years ago when we were looking to make matches, and there were some fighters that were had advanced further than he did, uh, like uh, Lamont Peterson. And we asked Peterson's manager, Barry Hunter, uh, we got a fight for you. Uh, Lamont against Mike Alvarado, and I'll never forget what Barry said to me. Hey, Bob, anybody but Mike Alvarado. And at that point, I really knew that we had something. Uh, Mike Alvarado gives his all in the ring, very pleasing fighter, crowd favorite. Uh, I know he was disappointed with the result of his last fight and vowed it wouldn't happen again. But please welcome one of the great fighters today, Mike Alvarado. Thank you, Bob. Good afternoon. Just want to thank God, you know, without him, this whole opportunity wouldn't be here right now. Uh, top rank, the whole organization. Um, I'm just honored at this point right now. Uh, really excited for this opportunity at hand. So, you know, I, I train hard. I, I'm ready for this fight. It was, it was great, you know, the, being, you know, in training camp this time away, you know, I just to myself. I did a lot of soul searching for this fight. So, you know, I, I know it's going to be a great fight. I thank Juan Manuel for, you know, giving me this honor to, to fight, you know, and to prove myself and to show that I belong on this stage, this level of fighting. So, I'm just, you know, blessed and I'm just happy for this opportunity. And I just thank everybody that's, you know, been here and that's been there for me, my family that's traveled to, to you know, be here for me and, you know, everybody that's that's been on my side. So, you know, I'm, I'm blessed for this opportunity. I'm just excited and, and I'm ready to show, you know, I'm ready to showcase it and show that, you know, I belong on this level. So, you know, I thank everybody and I appreciate, you know, 
everyone that's that's been rooting for me, and I appreciate it. So thank you, and God bless. You. And now to introduce the great Juan Manuel Marquez, calling on our partner Fernando Beltran. Uh, first of all, I, I think it's going to be a sensational fight. Uh, both fighters are uh, great fighters and uh, they train themselves uh, very good for this fight. And uh, this venue, first I would like to thank uh, HBO for putting this fight together, Peter Nelson and, and all the team of HBO. I think uh, for far they are the best network. And uh, also I would like to thank uh, Tecate, uh, who's the sponsor of this fight, and uh, the forum, uh, this building is a legend building, and who better than Juan Manuel Marquez to open it up? Who better than him? He started here, he made a great career here, and uh, he he have uh, he has no losses here, and this Saturday is not going to be an exception. I I believe that. Uh, that he came very good prepared, and uh, he's a he's not an A fighter. He's a triple A fighter. He's a sensational fighter, and uh, I believe that uh, that uh, this in this Saturday he's gonna prove it to all of you. He's excited uh, to fight in this venue because he fought here many years ago, and uh, right now he's very excited to to listen to the sound of the belt and uh, start the first round with uh, Michael Morales, who we respect a lot and uh, we believe that he's going to make a sensational fight. Please let me introduce you to the best Mexican fighter right now and the best Mexican fighter probably in the history of boxing, Juan Manuel Marquez. Good afternoon everyone. I feel very exciting because I fight again in this historical building. Uh, I feel very happy. Uh, I, I, I saw, I see, I see a new face. I see an old face, like uh, Carlos Avila. There's a, a lot of people here. Um, a lot of people knows me. I don't like, I don't like talking outside the ring. I doing, I doing my job on the ring. Uh, I have, I have, uh, for this fight, I have three points in my mind. Number one, Michael Alvarado is a, a strong fighter, he's a great fighter, and I have a tough fight. Number two, I prepare myself very hard for this fight, because this fight will be a war. And number three, the people will see a great, great fight, because Mike Alvarado wants, wants, win, wants to win the fight, I want to win the fight, is this fight uh, will be our. Thank you very much. Buenas tardes a todos. Estoy muy agradecido de de pelear aquí otra vez, el lugar que me vio crecer. Veo caras de cuando empecé como Carlitos Ávila, mucha gente que te conocí hace 18 años, hace 19 años y, y la verdad que Estoy muy emocionado por regresar a pelear aquí en este gran lugar que tiene mucha historia y que para mí es un, un gran honor poderlo hacer. Y siempre lo he dicho, mucha gente me conoce, no me gusta hablar fuera del ring, me gusta hacer mi trabajo eh, dentro del, del cuadrilátero y, y tengo tres puntos en mi mente para la pelea de este próximo sábado. Que el primer punto es que Mike Alvarado es un peleador duro, un peleador difícil, un peleador fuerte, El segundo punto es que me he preparado muy duro porque esta pelea va a ser una guerra. Y el tercer punto, que para mí es el más importante, que la gente va a ver una gran pelea. Y eso es lo que quiere ver la gente aquí en Los Ángeles, que son conocedores de boxeo, que saben que un peleador arriba del ring da lo mejor de sí, pero más un mexicano que se muere en la raya. Muchas gracias.